We can now, here in Nardo, fine-tune the Battista's bespoke chassis and our outstanding four-motor torque vectoring system in the real world. Then we are optimizing the performance overall, working on the spring, the tires, the dampers, and little by little we will also come to the point of refining the calibration of all the software of the Battista. We will have five drive modes in the Battista, overall allowing the driver to adapt the software and the calibration of the car according to the driving condition. The thing, testing and developing the Batista on the handling track, is that even without doing hot laps or trying to push the car to the absolute limit, the speeds that this car can achieve are absolutely impressive, to the point that even with part throttle, many times I have to actually modulate the applications in order not to exceed what I would like to achieve with speeds at this point of the development phase. The performance of the Batista cannot be matched by any other internal combustion engine car currently on the market. And the reason is very simple. We have more than 1900 horsepower that basically they can be delivered with an instance, a few milliseconds of, of, from the throttle application. What I really like of the Battista is the fact that uh, you, you, you see the car from the outside and it impresses you, it excites you from the design perspective. Uh, then you enter the car and you have this kind of uh, love with the interior, the ergonomics, the way you feel really the car, everything is where you would like it to be. Then you drive the car and the car is balanced in terms of weight distribution, front and rear, in terms of uh, uh, the battery pack which has been developed in order to really be in the center, in the lower part of the vehicle. And this allows you to have the car which at the end is not squaring you, nevertheless the performance. Then of course the performance is coming and is exciting you even more, but you always keep and feel yourself very safe.